Hi there, all lifters and non-lifters, this is DRS2. So this time I want to show you something very different. It's a very short uh, demo overview of a room. It's called, the, co the whole program is called fourth floor. And it's a very, very, very uh, short overview of a flat. And this is just a uh, very simple example of what virtual reality will probably be capable of in the near future. Well, there are some things with, which still uh, needs adjusting and this means uh, better resolution, better response times to make the uh, feeling more comfortable to more people. So, let's check this out. Okay, so here I am in the room. It's actually a part of a very small flat. So this is a very interesting example for all people which, stu which are studying architecture, which are uh, comfortable uh, designing apartment elements like furniture. Uh, I, I don't know, I'm not an expert in this uh, region, but all kinds of stuff. And this demo was uh, showing, oh, <laughs> someone had fun throwing their food on the wall. I don't know. <laughs> okay, and look at all the dust particles flying around. This room wasn't probably tidy up. <laughs> So, uh, it's a very nice example, as I said, to, to, to all of the all of people which are doing something with architecture. You can see all the things like if they were there. Of course, you have to have smooth frame rates. And mine is a little bit... it's okay, but still... And yeah, and the, the angle at which I am changing right now, I'm only moving with my mouse right. So... It's, it's a feeling like someone would turn me on a table, so I'm getting a little bit nausea from this movement, but I think this will be worked on later. And from this view, it looks really, f really like, like you're there. It's very real. So it's, it's kind of nice to have an overview of a flat where you will be living as a concept, probably, <laughs> in the near, near future. So this is one of the segments which actually will be considered in virtual reality. Of course, also the medical one. Uh, yeah, and very interesting thing. I do not have any... <laughs> I can't see myself in the mirror. Maybe I'm a vampire. Well, okay, it's daytime, so I would probably suffer from the light. <laughs> but I... Or maybe I'm a ghost, I don't know. But I can see myself. And yeah, all the objects are very detailed. And you can actually see how they are changing when I move. And I actually bumped onto my microphone right now. <laughs> because I wanted so much to have a closer look. So what... Do we have here some books, yoga sequencing, and modern calligraphy? Yeah, also a type machine, of course a laptop, a very low poly and very flattened <laughs> keyboard, I don't know. Well, some elements look, look really great, but all the others not so much. I see some boxes around here and there. So, we saw the kitchen, the living room, I guess. It's a very small apartment. Can I go through here? I don't know why, but I cannot. Yeah, I can. Okay. So I think somebody was really playing already with the, the, the uh, possibilities of virtual reality. And it's a very nice way to, uh, to show this piece of hardware of just doing this kind of demos. So if I find uh, any different programs showcasing... Uh, furniture, uh, interiors like that, using virtual reality, I will give some demos just to show you how it looks. So, thanks for watching this very short video and enjoy my new, vi new upcoming videos. Bye bye.